time for blood. Yeah. For the Inquisition. Ah, that's right. Run. Yeah. For the Inquisition. You For the Inquisition. Murderer. You died for that. I need to talk to you about the Inquisitor. What is wrong? Why are you not with him? Mendoza has lost it. He's endangering the lives of us all. He's even prepared to sacrifice this island. You found something inside the volcano then? I have to talk to Don Esteban. If what you say is true, then this concerns everyone here. We must work together. There is a fire titan imprisoned within the island. Mendoza wants to free it, to control it. And if this goes wrong, then we will be destroyed. And if the Inquisitor gets things right, the titan's presence is preventing the island from being destroyed by the storm. The titan leaves, we're all done for. Surely Mendoza realizes this. Yes, but he thinks he can control the titan. The storms out there are caused by titans. 
The Inquisitor wants to use this one to free the mainland from the threat of the others. He is prepared to make any sacrifice to achieve that. How does he think he can control it? The spirit of the Titan Lord still inhabits the mountain. The Inquisitor is using his secrets, but if I can find the Titan Lord's armor, I can lock the Titan back in its prison, but I don't have much time. Once the Titan is free and in full possession of its powers... Then this island is doomed. You can count on our help. Where do we find this armor? The pieces of armor lie in the tombs of the Lizard Priests, but they are guarded. Here, I'll show you where the tombs are on the map. Hmm. One tomb is in the Don's camp. Then you will need to find a way to convince him to let you in there. What will you do about the Inquisitor? We are the guardians of the Holy Flame. We protect the island. The Inquisitor has become a threat to those things, and so he has become our enemy. What about the rest of the Inquisition here? Who will they side with? Commandant Carlos will influence the others. He is the highest ranking member of the Inquisition. We can only hope that his loyalty is to the cause and not to the man. Talk to him and explain everything. I hope he will help us. I found this rune, but I can't use it. Then you should speak to Master Illumar. He will help you with it. I have found a rune. The old knowledge demands a clear mind filled with wisdom. That doesn't help me. If you are wise, you will take this to Master Iluma. Master Abrax, I have a rune stone. Have you? Let me see. I can decode its structure, but if it's scrolls you want, you should go to Master Iluma and here. You will also need these plants to create the scroll. I have a rune that will destroy barriers. Let me see. I've never seen a rune like it. Take it to Master Illuma. Ask him to create some scrolls from it. Let's trade. I found a rune. Please show it to me. From the look of this, it appears to be designed to remove magical barriers. See here. This relates to walls. This to magic. It sounds useful, but I can't do anything with it. I can, though. I shall make some scrolls for you. I can teach you to create scrolls for yourself. You will need a blank parchment and a quill as well as a rune and some special ingredients. You'll see which ingredients you need if you stand at the rune table. How do I create a magic scroll? In order to create a scroll, you require a template, a rune. You will need to copy the magical structure of that rune onto a parchment on a rune table. In order to fix the magic in the parchment, you will need specific ingredients depending on the spell you seek to store. Master, I need scrolls.
I'll create the scrolls myself. As you wish. Here, take your rune. You will need it. I need a quill. Let's trade. Need potions. Let's trade. I do not wish to be bothered right now. I'm sure you have other things to do. That's finished that. Looks good. That's finished that. That's done.
That's finished. I need a dull blade. Let's trade. I'm looking for the tombs of some Saurian high priests. Not seen anything like that. But there is one ruin near here, sealed with some sort of magical barrier. Maybe there's one of these tombs in there. But that's also where the... Wait, we're under attack. To arms. Looks like the raid's over. They'll be back. These things have been coming up like termites. You did good work. No problem. If there's anything else... Just help us do whatever is necessary to make the attack stop.
Let's trade. Let's trade. Teach me some combat skills. Teach me sword fighting. So far, You've won your fights mainly through speed? Well, sometimes you've got to put all your strength into an attack. Keep enough distance from your opponent, though. Otherwise, you won't have enough momentum. You'll have to pack all your power into one strike and unleash it on your foe. If you've done everything right, you'll have a large reach and can do a lot of damage. You might even knock aside your opponent's parry, follow up immediately with another attack, and they won't stand a chance. I'm just dreaming about gold. Please don't disturb me. I need some potions. I heard that an outlaw had accompanied the Inquisitor inside the mountain. It wasn't difficult to guess that you were that man. Why are you alone? What have you done with Mendoza? The Inquisitor is still inside the volcano. What did you find in there? A fire titan. A titan? We found a fire titan, trapped within the mountain. What if it escapes? If it escapes, the island will be destroyed, burnt to a crisp. But it has been trapped for over a thousand years. There's an edge to that good news. If we disturb things inside the mountain, the fire titan may be released. The Inquisitor will understand that. The Inquisitor is trying to release the titan. He thinks he can use it. He said he was seeking for a weapon. But if he can't control it, if it gets loose, the whole island will be destroyed. If he can, the Inquisitor will march the Titan away from here. But it's the Titan's presence that has protected the island. So, if he succeeds, or he fails, the whole island will be destroyed. What do you think about the Inquisitor now? He and I have fought many battles together. And I was always his loyal retainer. But since he found that ocular, he has changed. He broods, has grown introverted. He has been driven 
He has a plan. But I think he's losing sight of the reasons he is doing what he is doing. The Inquisitor Mendoza I swore allegiance to would have acted differently. Then you must help me to stop him. The best I can do is act to stop these lizard men from interfering with your quest. Although you are one of the Don's bandits, you have always proven your loyalty to your cause. If you give me your word to act for the good of the island, I will believe you. I give you my word. So how can you help me? I will give you some scrolls to help you in your fight. Your work here in the town is finished. What are you talking about? Who sent you? Don Esteban? It's time to move on. The Inquisition is done here. I don't accept orders from the Don. There's no more reason for your warriors to stay here in Harbour Town. The crystal discs have been found and the gate in the monastery has been opened. Your duties lie in defending the flame, not the town. Then all our efforts here are to go to waste? Very well. My men and I will leave the town, but remember, the Inquisition rules this island. We do it for the people. If you take this town, the people become your responsibility. Treat them with care. Look after their needs. So, my men have withdrawn. I hope you are satisfied. Now is not the time to talk. Maybe with the order gone, my boys will come back to town. Well, I can hope. The Don's come to save us. Come to exploit us, more like. If you want to buy something, please be quick and then leave carefully. What with the Don being back, I want to keep a low profile until the dust has settled. You did it! The town is finally back in my hands. My town. Our town. I'm making you my captain. A captain amongst my men. Now our paths diverge once more. You must continue with your work inside the volcano. We must know its secrets. And I will go to the town, let the people know that they are free once more. We are all counting on you, Captain. If I'm to serve, I'll need better armor. I need armor fit for a captain. It has been well earned. If I stay on this island, I want to earn my place. Then wear that armor with pride and stand. What are you planning to do with all the gold you're collecting? The Inquisition have fear on their side. We need another weapon. Gold. Gold can buy a man's loyalty and twist his soul. And soon we shall see which is the stronger. Fear of man or love of money. I have come seeking your help. With what? With the Saurian Fortress. Well, I don't see what I can do to help with that. I have no men to spare, no knowledge of what you may face. Still, doing nothing does not help me, does it? And I am not unsympathetic. All I can do for you is give you this potion. I've had this for a long time, waiting for the moment it would be needed. I think the time has come. I will give it to you. Don't waste it. Better than nothing. Thank you. Good work, Captain. It's about time the Don finally came home. Now things have calmed down. I can finally catch a few winks now and then. I've got
got some obsidian for you. Have you now? Give me an obsidian blank for a two-handed sword. Here you are. Give me an obsidian blank for a two-handed sword. Here you are. I have some iron ore for you. Well, what do you want made from it? I need a blank. Looks good. That's done. I need a dull blade. The warriors are finally gone. Smug lot. I hope they stay away. So, the Don is back. That better not interfere with honest business. Buy your potions and wipe that stupid grin off your face. You going to stand here all day? What? I'm not listening. What are you doing? Welcome, Captain.